Hey folks, it's been a while since I've done a devlog. Um, let's do one. I'm working on a project and we're moving it onto the Android platform. Android has a limit to how big your initial download can be and the game does not fit. So we're gonna need to pack it into asset packs. Android has a way to do that. Unity has something that sort of integrates with that, but it, it doesn't work all by itself. So I'm looking into how do I take a scene, pack the scene into an asset bundle, and then move that asset bundle into the Android streaming package. I've created a little test project here that will let me uh, just load a scene. This is my scene loader, and I have in here a single object with a little simple script on it that will load the scene, and I'm just gonna load scene one, after some delay so that I can see that happening. Okay, so let's see that happening. Three, two, one, go. And we load our scene and we have a lovely little scene. Okay, so the next step um, I want to try to do is to put, I don't need sample scene, let's get rid of that. Put this scene that is loaded into an asset bundle. So we'll call that um, scene one asset bundle. And uh, to make asset bundles, you have to add this create asset bundle script. Let's go for it. Uh, that's under assets, isn't it? Yeah, there we go. Build asset bundles. All right, we've got an asset bundle. What did that do? Uh, didn't work is what it did. Interesting. Okay, the scene is supposedly part of an asset bundle, but build asset bundles didn't do anything. It didn't output anything. Let's take a look at that script. Okay, asset, asset bundles. We create the directory if it doesn't exist. Great, it already exists, I made it. Um, just says build asset bundles. Okay, why didn't it work? Okay, uh, making sure it did not work. Oh wait, 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 it did work. I don't know. <laughs> Looks like there you need to do something. Uh, I forgot. Unity has something where you have to Unity mark. You have to mark something dirty. Okay. I, I don't know. I'm not going to worry about it. Um, it it did make my asset bundle. So there's my asset bundle. Let's look at that in the Explorer. It's 87k for this scene. It looks like now. Uh, my test, my next test is, let's just run this and see if it can still load the scene now that it's in an asset bundle. It does still load the scene, at least when I play an editor. Let's do a build. Build settings, let's do a build. Uh, I don't know, new folder, build PC, go. Okay, my thinking is that because now that this is, this is in an asset bundle, it should not be able to load the scene until I first load the asset bundle. That's my understanding. But is that true? Three, two, one. No, see, it works fine. Um, which makes me think it didn't successfully put anything into the asset bundle. And now I realize I need a way to kill this. Um, it didn't successfully put anything into the asset bundle. Uh, let's take a look at, at what data did we get. We got, yeah, there's two levels here. So I have level one, I have level zero. And then, blah, 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 blah. what if, Okay, what if we do this now? Let's take that out and do a build. Uh, let's make a new folder. Build PC2. 
Let's try that. What happens if I now remove scene one from the build, but hopefully because it's in the asset bundle, it'll still be there. So now when I load, yeah, go away. Three, two, one, and it cannot load. Okay. All right, so next up, let's see if we can load the asset bundle before we try loading the scene. Okay, uh, so what have I done? Uh, let's try this. We're gonna put the asset bundle into the streaming assets. We're gonna load that file, and then we're gonna try to pull the asset bundle out of that file and see what that happens here. Okay, so uh, let's add a little more, more text. Debug.log uh, asset bundle loaded. And what else? Let's put this right here. And now, um, Let's see, yes, yeah, just put a debug.log attempting to create scene. Okay, so I've loaded the asset bundle and I'm not doing anything with the asset bundle. Can I then suddenly just load a scene? Let's find out. Uh, yeah, can I just do this? Two, one, loading asset bundle, what's the problem? Oh yeah, look at this. There was no such scene. Okay, because I didn't do that yet. Alrighty, that's because I need to take the asset bundle and move it to streaming assets. And I've noticed this, uh, Unity won't let me do that. Um, what I've got to do is go to the file explorer. I'm gonna take this asset bundle and move it to streaming assets. Now let's try playing editor. Two, one, go. Wow, that worked. Well, it worked in editor. Um, let's verify that the loading of the asset bundle made that happen. Let's turn off the loading of the asset bundle. and try, because maybe I have to do a build. Three, two, one, go. Indeed, um, that's the secret sauce. All right, so we figured out that uh, you can put a scene into an asset bundle and then put that asset bundle into the streaming folder. And then if you turn off the scene from your build list, you then need to load in the asset bundle before you can load that scene, but that works. So if you want to move the scene into like the, a streaming asset that you that you put in a separate Android pack, that's what you're going to have to do. You have to first put the scene into an asset bundle. Second, remove the scene from your scene list in the build settings. Then build that asset bundle and move the asset bundle out of asset bundles into streaming assets. Do all those things, and now you can load the asset bundle from streaming and then load the scene. You don't have to do anything special, just if you've loaded the asset bundle, you can load a scene that's, that's in there. Now my next question is, what was included in that asset bundle? Uh, I wanna move not just the scene, but all of the scene contents. Um, the idea is I have to reduce my memory footprint, and it's not the scene file that's giving me trouble. It's, you know, textures and sounds and models. Oh, my. So let's get some textures and models going in this thing. Um, what are we going to use? Let's get, uh, I don't know, let's just go like, uh, where have I got some textures? 485, got some textures. Um, I don't know, let's just like assets textures let's put let's throw i want something pretty big actually let's put the normal map 
Uh, let's put a normal map in there. Let's put some sounds in there. We got some, uh, need something I own the license to, right? Um, <laughs> I mean, it's not that important, right? Nobody's going to care, but oh, uh, music. It's in the music folder. Naturally. Oh, these are MP3s. Okay, well, that's fine. Uh, let's, let's put this in here. Boom. Okay, and the reason I want to do that is because I want to convert it to a Vorbis. I want it to be streaming. Okay, and let's put these things in on something. Let's see. Can I just drag that out? No, I gotta make it. I gotta make a material. Create myself a material. Oh my gosh, so much stuff these days. Material. Uh, you know what could be fun is let's put that on the normal map. And let's see. Is that gonna what's that gonna look like just for fun okay so cool um i got a something something okay so I've got, so i've got a texture uh and it's gonna be you know 0.7 megs and i got this thing and it's gonna be converted to a vorbis okay this is all good let's save our scene material using the texture as a normal map Oh, okay, fix it. Yeah, I want that normal map to be a normal map. So let's build this thing. Let's do build asset bundles. Okay, did it build the asset bundle? Hard to tell because this thing doesn't update, but um, show an explorer. It did build the asset bundle. So what we got to do is move it over and replace the old asset bundle. So now, we're, yeah, we're over a megabyte. So it seems like it must have included stuff. Let's do a build. Build settings. We're going to go and we're going to build new folder, build PC3. Do that. Go. So I'm curious, um, did the file size increase by the, by the expected amount? And, uh, and is it in the streaming assets that we got, like we should have over a megabyte now? Okay, build two, 67.7, this is 68.9. So yeah, 1.2 megs went in there where did they go let's take a look um, they have obviously gone into the data folder this one has level zero hasn't grown any resources hasn't grown any shared assets hasn't grown any uh, but this one has a streaming assets folder and the streaming assets folder has that extra megabyte in it. Okay, so um, does it work? Let's try it. Uh, let's see. Build three, run it. Three, two, one, go. It doesn't seem to be going. That's no good. Let's let's play in. Uh, let's get back to the loader scene. Let's see if we can see anything obvious. Two, one. Okay, scene one couldn't be loaded because it has not been added to the build settings. Or the, oh, right. <laughs> I forgot um, to turn this back on. Okay, we're going to turn on the loading loading bundle now. That confirms at least that uh, that without loading the asset bundle, we definitely did not get scene one included. So here we go. Three, two, one. Boom. And there it is with the textures on it. So I'm pretty confident this is going to work. Um, I'll go ahead and rebuild build three. All right, now all I have to do now is to do the specific Android version of this, which there's an Android packing thing that should be no problem, uh, and there's a quick little API 
Uh, and I'll do that now.